Hello, I'm Grace Bryan of Nitrogen uh, here with Advisorpedia at the 2023 Fearless Investing Summit. And we are here today with Justin Boatman, our Chief Product Officer at Nitrogen. Welcome, Justin. Thank you. I'm getting interviewed by the Grace Bryan. This is awesome. <laughs> Um, can you share how Nitrogen is addressing the evolving needs of today's investors? Yeah, today's investors are going through a lot, right? I mean, the markets are maybe more uncertain feeling to the average investor than they were in the past decade, right? And so uh, investors are combating this unknown, this fearfulness, right? Um, our mission of empowering the world to invest fearlessly means that the advisors using the Nitrogen platform can help keep those clients fearless, right? But, but today's investors out there uh, aren't really sure what's going on in a lot of different ways. And in order to reach them, um, you know, advisors know they can't be full-time marketers, right? But they need content to be able to go reach these investors where they're at. Uh, and the toughest part about that is just getting started. So one of the things we announced um, today or covered was Nitrogen AI. We released that earlier this year. And Nitrogen AI is just a great way for you know, built on those language learning models, AI capability, the advisor can go in and generate fresh content as a starting template before they, you know, personalize it, make sure it's compliant, have their own insights and stuff. But we just want to save advisors hours of work to get started and get over that hump so that they can get content out there and reach today's investors who are maybe even more fearful uh, than they would have been for the prior decade or so. Amazing. And I know you shared about this in the Nitrogen keynote today uh, from the main stage, but can you share any recent developments to the Nitrogen growth platform that customers and investors can be excited about? Oh, yeah. Yeah, we're just coming off a, a really fun uh, product keynote segment where we got to show off uh, a, a bunch of things. One of them, um, you know, we've just been working on this insights feature this summer. Um, and so our latest feature I'm super excited about. Uh, and insights in our firm-wide plans, which are Nitrogen Ignite and Nitrogen Ultimate. Insights really stitches together your firm-wide data feed in a way that lets you run risk and growth analysis on your whole AUM, right? And so these firms that are these ensemble advisors of three, four, nine, ten plus, or a thousand firms, they want to be able to see what's the risk of my book of business, uh, what's the growth in my AUM? How does that compare against firms like mine? And then also, how can I tell my advisors apart and filter by some things and go, what's the difference in my advisor's book of business? We just think that you can't really grow what you can't measure. And so that's where we're applying the risk number and all these analytics at scale uh, at firm wide. And so Trisha Rothschild, who's on our board of directors, uh, demoed that in today's product keynote is the insights feature that we released this summer. Uh, I'm super excited about that one. Um, and then in terms of, you know, features for kind of advisor client workflows, we went through a lot of things that we're doing in portfolios to make the experience snappier. And we released new heat maps features and features with annuities and things today in the core of our experience. And so that was really fun. I think um, my favorite thing that we announced today is our new reports builder. Um, one of the reasons it's my favorite thing is just we get product requests about reports more than any other feature in our tool. Advisors use it all the time. Advisors generate over a half a million reports in our platform. And whereas our platform used to have different types of reports in different corners, right? If we get the stats feature, I could go generate a stats report out of the stats feature or an IPS is our most popular report that's generated. I can go to a client's profile and generate an IPS or I can go generate a retirement map report in the retirement maps feature. Now I've got this unified reports builder built on what we call elements. And so the elements have all been redesigned, they're gorgeous, and now advisors can mix and match those. So if I wanted something that I used to be able to find in the stats report, I can add that into my IPS, I can do customization, and then you know, larger scale firms who wanna apply guardrails on that can say, hey, here are the elements that we want in our elements library that firms either must use or can't use or can use. Um, and then one fun little cherry on top for me is we've applied firm-wide brand controls now where you throw us any primary and secondary color and our designers and developers work together to come up with a way where any color you throw us we can algorithmically generate a series of tones that's going to always be readable it's always going to be beautiful it's always going to match the firm's brand um, we just think that reports are something that should be about the advisory firm's brand not ours right this is not us trying to build nitrogen rapport with clients clients should look at reports and see the brand that is their advisor, their team, they recognize it, right? And so those new controls 
are going to make the beautiful new reports just that much more applicable to the brand. So as you can tell, I'm pretty excited about it. But That's amazing. Thank you so much for being here with us today. 